I do get a lot of questions about my range of motion because I have had a fusion but obviously you can still see me moving in my videos and that is because my fusion was not done in one surgery it was actually done in a series of about 10 surgeries maybe maybe eight or nine because I think a couple of those weren't really fusions they were just um, tethered cord stuff and whatever so there is a spot between my C2 and my C3 vertebra, my second and third, in my neck where I do not have metal. I don't have instrumentation, so I have a plate above it and I have a plate below it, but between the C2 and 3, there is no metal. There is what we call kind of a flexible fiber tape, so that's a like a flexible fusion. And then he also went in with donor bone and bone marrow so that creates kind of a natural fusion but it isn't as sturdy as the metal so after my surgery he had me out of the neck brace and moving a bit earlier than you would normally do it after a fusion so that we could try to stiffen the area with that bone but also maintain a little bit of movement so I would be able to move my head a bit. Anyway, I thought that maybe I would give you guys a little peek into my range of motion. Hello! So like I said, I do have a little spot right about here that has a flexible fusion instead of having hardware. So I do have some movement there and then I believe that I have a bit more of that tape right about here, right above where my neck, my cervical meets my thoracic. So I have a tiny bit of movement there. And then from there, I think my thoracic is hard fused down to about T10, where it starts to just get a little bit more complicated with flexible systems and bone and grafts and tape all the way down to the bottom of my lumbar. So this is straight on. And then looking down, not very far, and then back up, and looking up, not very far either. Okay, now this is to the left, and this is to the right. All right, here's from the side. As you can see, I do kind of have a bit of a curve and I tend to have a forward head posture, which isn't really great, but I'm working on it. So side view, down, back, left, right. So as you can see, I don't really have a lot of functional movement, especially since I am also fused in the thoracic, so I cannot twist. If someone calls my name, I have to turn my whole body. I can't um, really turn very well to see them. But it is so much better than it was before surgery, even losing this range of motion. I feel that I will be able to get to a point where I am more functional this way than I was like that. Although I probably won't be going back to the competitive gymnastics.